What's up, guys? It's Dolly Keen Liquid. Well, Oostergrab was a bust. After wading through a marsh, fighting bandits, necromancers, and drugger, all I found was a statue of a hand clutching a note. I need to speak to you. Urgently. Rent the attic room at the Sleeping Giant Inn in Riverwood, and I'll meet you. A friend. Seriously? All that did was leave me with questions. How did they know where the Jergenwood Caller's horn was? The Greybeards haven't talked to anyone in years, up until I walked through their front door. And how did they know I was going after it? I guess I'll find out when I get to Riverwood. Yes, my thing? Alright, Lydia, let's head back to Marathal. We'll try to catch a ride back to Whiterun, so we can head to Riverwood. I've got your back. Thanks. Let's roll out. Let's do it up to. What's up, guy? The mill is my responsibility. And that's what I care about. That's all. Understand? Yeah, I get it. You seem upset about something. The world's going mad, and our Jarl does what? She hides inside with her visions. We need a leader, not some mystic. You don't trust the Jarl? How can I? She never speaks with us. She has allowed this wizard, Falcon, to live in our midst practicing gods know what. And now there's talk of rebellion and dragons? What help could Idgrat be against them? No. We can only rely on ourselves. You do well to remember that. Well, isn't the old dear own with? Trust you saw the house that burned down. Yeah. Peculiar bit of business that was. And that's on top of noises from the marsh in the night. Tales of monsters. Now this wizard in our mist. What's a man to do if he can't look to his yard for help? Oh. All right. All right. Have a nice day. What time it is? Fifty-three. Shop should be opening soon. If there are any. What could it mean? The return of the Dragonborn? And who among us could possibly hold that honor and such power? Uh, yeah, that's a that's a good question. Hey, is there a story behind that burned down house? It's bad luck to talk about that place. Yar's been looking for someone who ain't superstitious, though. Be looking for a fool if you ask me. Mm-hmm. Talk to the Jarl to see what's up. Everybody around here seems a little bit cranky. Someone do something. I'm getting out what of here. What was that? What was that? What was what? Shoot. Vampire. Dude, are you okay? I'm just here to protect the Jarl, not to chat. Oh, fine. Vampire armor. These boots look kind of dope, though. What are these vampires doing here? Alright, I'm gonna taste some of this vampire dust to see what the hell the thing is. Ooh, 
visibility, huh? That's kind of awesome. Oh, hell no. Hang on. Oh, good. Can I sell some of this stuff? PM. aren't opening. It's closing. So I don't see any sharp shops. I see a lot of grindstones though. If you need, Jorgen and I both work hard, all the time. Murthal is important to both of us. Do you have a hard time getting supplies way out here? No, no. Well, sometimes, but that's not the problem. I just often don't have much to do, so I tend to... try things out. They don't usually work, but I try. Next thing I know, I've used up most of my stock. Life has brought you to Morthal, and to me. What purpose this serves, we will no doubt see. Welcome. There's some kind of trouble in Morthal? That which is unknown can create unease, even fear. It is to be expected. Some fear our new resident wizard. As they grow to know him, they will accept him. Time will prove me right. I hear you want someone to look into the f to that house fire. Rogar's house fire? Well, he lost his wife and daughter in the blaze. My people believe it to be cursed now. Who am I to gainsay them? What does Haggard say happen? Rogar blames his wife for spilling bear fat in the fire. Many folk think he set the fire himself. Why would he do that to his own family? Lust can make a man do the unthinkable. The ashes were still warm when he pledged himself to Alpha. So why haven't you arrested him? On rumor and gossip? No. But you, a stranger, might find the truth for us. Sift through the ashes that others are too fearful to touch. See what they tell you. Should you prove him guilty or innocent, I will reward you. Rogar's fate is in your hands. All right. Looks like we're detectives. Let's go, Lydia. says I'm not supposed to talk to strangers. 
Are you a stranger? No, I'm a friend. Do you know what happened to your house? The smoke woke me up. I was hot and I was scared. So I hid. Then it got cold and dark. I'm not scared anymore. But I'm lonely. Will you play with me? If I do, will you tell me who set the fire? Okay, let's play hide and seek. You find me, and I'll tell you. We have to wait for nighttime, though. The other one is playing, too, and she can't come out until then. The other one? What do you mean? I can't tell you. She might hear me. She's so close. If you can find me first, I can tell you. I've got your back. But I need you to. She disappeared to. Have you seen Layla? Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Leolet? Have you seen my wife? Have you seen Leolet? Have you seen my wife? No. Mommy and me, but she didn't want to. She wanted to play with me forever and ever. She kissed me on the neck, and I got so cold that the fire didn't even hurt. Leila thought she could take me and keep me, but she can't. I'm all burned up. She's a vampire. I'm tired. I'm gonna sleep for a while now. Leila, she's dead. He's beard. She's, she's a vampire. Hey. Get over here. She's dead. Leolette is Leolette. What can you tell me about I your wife? I thought she left to join the Stormcloaks. Oh, my poor Leolette. Did you notice anything strange before she left? She began to spend a lot of time with Alva. Yet just a week before, she despised her. In fact, the night she disappeared, she was supposed to meet Alva. Alva told me later that she never showed up. I never got to tell her goodbye. I think they may have met after all. You think Alva? But that means... Ye gods! You think Alva is a vampire? It's a possibility. We can't ignore. No, you're wrong. You must be wrong. Leolet may have met her fate out in the marsh. I refuse to believe Alva had anything to do with this. There is no way you can prove it to the Jarl. I hope Alva is not what you think. Let me see. She is a vampire. I'm not trying to investigate her house at night. Dr. 
Rogar. right here. Staying at night, all right. I hear there ain't much to offer, but if you want a place dry to spend the night, I'll rent you a room. Hey, what can you tell me about Leolette? Now there's a mystery. She ran away when the war started. Her husband Thania was devastated. No note or nothing. I'm pretty sure she up and joined the Stormcloaks. Like to run a room? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Like this way. <laughs> Let me know if there's anything else you need. No, I'm good, thank you. For? Why, good evening, Yana. What can I get you, Alva? What can't you get me, sweetie? Um, did you want something to eat? Eat? No, I don't think I'm hungry. Not now, at least. Right. Okay. Uh, tell me if you change your mind. Why are you in my bedroom? Nothing to fear. Old Norbert will brighten your spirits. Just lend him your ear. Alright, dude. The good people of Morthal have yet to embrace my talent. Hey. Try as you may. They won't say good day, but we'll just walk away. Worry not, Morthal. Norbert is here to stay. What do you do around here? I'm a bard. Trained at the Bard's College in Solitude. Wanderers like you should think about applying. Maybe. Fight well. What time is it?
like she's leaving town. Oh, sweet. Gods, it's true, isn't it? A dragon has attacked Whiterun. How could mere men bring down such a beast? Uh, she just went to her house. Yes, my thing. Got your back. See if there's a look, she's got like boot, a dagger. this place. Something under her. My life is dreary. My life is dreary. Where is my prince? Come to rescue me. Where is my bold Nord, warrior, to sweep me off my feet? I met a man today when, when picking flower. He is exciting and exotic. We kissed it in the moonlight. It was so romantic. I'm going to see him again tonight. 
now understand the true colors of the night. Moroth. Moroth. Morath? Mo Movarth. Movarth has shown me the true black of night and the true red of blood. He has promised me a feast of blood if I do his bidding in Morthal. Krogar was easy to seduce. Movarth said I should find a protector first. Someone to watch over my coffin during the day. Krogar is perfect. Not this time. Lalette came to visit me tonight. She slaked my thirst. I've hidden her away to let her rise as my handmaiden. I spread the rumor in town that she left to join the war fool. fools. Movarth has confided his grand plan to me. I am to seduce the guardsmen one at a time and make them my slaves. Then he and the others from the coven can descend upon Morthal and take the entire town. We won't kill them. They will become cattle for our thirst. An endless supply of blood and an entire town to protect us from the cursed sun. Krogar's family is becoming inconvenient. I've told Lalette to kill them all. But make it look like an accident. Krogar must be seen as innocent if he is going to be my protector. That little fool, Lalette, burned Hogar's family alive. I asked for an accident, and she gave me a scandal. To make matters worse, he tried to turn his little girl. Hell yeah, except Lalette couldn't even get that right. She killed the child and left the body to burn. Something is wrong with Hollette. She keeps talking about Helgi. I think her mind has snapped. She seems to think that the child can still be brought back to be her companion. There is a stranger in town looking into the fire. I'll have to be careful. Definitely taking that. Well. this chick's house for new stuff. Well, she's dead, so she's not going to be missing these things. Is Rogar innocent or not? Alvar set the fire. She's the murderer. Alvar? Huh. Didn't think she had it in her. Actually, she's a vampire. She planned to enslave the town. I assume you have proof? Can't go making accusations like that without proof. I have Alvar's journal. So it's true. The traitorous bitch. Morthal owes you a debt. Here. You were promised a reward for solving the crime, but I need one more favor from you. Morthal is still in danger. The journal mentions Movarth, a master vampire I thought was destroyed a century ago. 
I'll gather together some able-bodied warriors to clean out Movart's lair. They'll be waiting outside for you to lead them. Okay. I understand you have visions. The Divines reveal things to me at times, yes. I do not hide this. It is a gift. Anyone who believes otherwise does not and cannot understand it. All right, then. How are you feeling, Yaru? The vision is continuing to hold me balanced. Help me. All right, there's no way I'm going to fight a master vampire without getting some some supplies. Take us to Movart's lair. Yes! Take us. Yeah! Kill the vampire! Kill him! Kill him! Calm down, everyone. Because out fighting dragons, and what do I get? God duty. Yeah, you sucked at it. Vampire. Oh, he's fighting with us. Buddy, I still got my back. You're joining in? Yeah. Oh, this place looks dangerous. Yeah, kind of scary, too. And it's full of vampires? Yeah. Cowards. We must kill the vampires. Hey! We have to make them pay! Of course. But why not let him go in first? Seriously? I thought we were boys, man. Don't fret over the gloom. There's nothing to fear. Old Lorbrook will brighten your spirits. Just lend him your ear. God damn it, Lorbrook. You, you're trying to throw me under the bus in here? The vampire cave, and you want me to go in? Oh, Jesus Christ. Lydia. What are you doing, standing back? Oh, fine. I'm just a poor man trying to make a living. I have I'd to... leave Mortal were it in my power. I have to go into the vampire lair alone. They may be cowards, but I'm not. I'll go with you. A brave man, let's go. Leads on. Mm-hmm. Weapon 
comes out, everyone. Hey. Seriously? Backstory upstairs, in the middle of something here. Take this coin purse. Let's 
sniper. Hey, watch! What's that? Everybody stay calm. Take out his minions. I know I heard something. What was that? I was sure I heard something. Look at you. If only everyone acted like you did. The Master Vampire of Mar Marvoth is dead. By the Eight? I didn't think he could do it. Now maybe we can put all this behind us. Take this as a token of our gratitude. Why, thank you. 400 gold is awesome for killing a Master Vampire. Anything else you need? There is room in my court for a new thing. It's an honorary title mainly, but there are a few perks someone like you could make use of. However, I could only grant the title to someone who is known throughout my hold. You help my people, and I'll make you my thing. It would be an honor. Good luck. Mm-hmm. If you've business with the Jarl, I'd ask that you speak to me first. How are you feeling? I do what I can to see that Idgrut's time isn't wasted, and that she only has to deal with important matters. So what was the so argument you? outside the hall? Do not worry, my friend. Ah, you saw that, did you? Life in Morthal has been troubled lately. The people are uncertain, restless, and nearly look to the Jarl for leadership. What's going wrong with Morthal? There's news of rebellion against the Empire. Strange noises have been heard in the marshes at night. And then, the tragedy with Rogar's home. The men simply seek wisdom. Everything will be fine. Alright, take care. Mm-hmm. 